What's up everybody, Frame Loss here, and today I have the most complicated build I've done for Mother Gunship. I have Thor's Hammer. Now, just looking at this thing, you can already see that it is a beast. Something that one should not reckon with. Uh, the power of the gods, if you will. So let's take a quick look just at the parts. We've got seven barrels on this thing. We have They're all the same, seven of the lightning rods. It's very important. Uh, three ricochet, a critical increase. A bunch of power increasers. We'll go over those as we add them. Some multi-shots and a spread. Now, I know what you guys want. You guys want to see it in action. But we're going to build this one first. We're going to do it a little different. And save the, the juicy bits for the end. So let's get this thing apart. Now, I'm going to show off the frame first. So what you're going to start with is the two-sided connector. Making sure it's going up and down. Add the two solids. Now, this is a new piece that I have to work with. Uh, this is the three connector oval. On the bottom one, we're going to add the triangles. Make sure the ends are facing out. Now, for the bottom here, we're going to go with another two side. And then on each one of these, we're going to do a three box facing outwards. So it looks something like that. For the top, just a standard four box. And this is the frame of Thor's hammer. Now, this is the biggest gun we've made. And these connectors are really important for adding the barrels. So let's add those so you can, get, you can start getting an idea of how this looks. Now, the first one, you want to start with it turned this way. And then every barrel you add after that, you're going to leave it on the default because that's how it fits. You're going to add two barrels up here, turning them slightly sideways so they face out. And then one barrel in the center there, and that's going to be all your barrels. So you can see the gun taking shape right now. In this center piece down here, that's where we're going to be adding our ricochet mods. Now, with better ricochet mods, we're definitely going to see better output. But for now, I just have the standard uh, ricochet mods. Add our critical right there. So this is going to be what the center of the gun looks like. Up top, we're going to add our multi-shot add-ons. Actually, I'm going to remove one put another blue one on on this very back piece we're going to be adding the precision module because that's going to increase our spread and that's important on the bottom here we're going to be adding our power circuits we'll face those down and then right here we're going to be adding the im841 heavyweights they increase damage by 40 percent and we don't have to worry, the, the minus 60 on speed, we don't have to really worry about. And you're going to see why in just a second. But that's the basic build of the gun. You can see this thing is a tank. And let's go check it out in the armory. It just, the, the key with this gun is you don't have to really aim. You can just put bullets wherever you want. It's going to clear the room. The spread is very important on this gun because you want those arcs to go everywhere. This is great for room clearing. That boy, I don't know how that boy just lived. It's it's random, so there, there are some little snafus, but with with the spread, you can't really can't really pick and choose where it goes. But it is highly effective. Just filling the room completely with lightning. Something something Thor would be very proud about. This has been Thor's Hammer. Uh, I wish I could show you more with it, but with the demo, I'm limited to what I can do inside this armory. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoy the gun.